Shalom, everybody. Hello from a very special place in Jerusalem. Let me spin this around here. Let's take a walk. I'm at a place called Gan HaKever, the garden tomb. Hello, Rachie. Hello, Fabricio. Hello, Beth Garrison. Hello, P.S. In upstate New York. Hello, Jason Scalzi. Alaska. Wow. Hello, Luana. Hello, Fabio. Hello, Anthony. Hello, Vincent. Hello, Sagar. Hello, Adenir. Hello, Miriam. Hello, Louis. Hello, Paulo. Hello, Ina. Hello, Stefano. Hello, Jeffrey Matthews. Summer Overby. Carolyn Theobald. Hello, Sweet Serenity. Hello, Raquel. Hello, uh, Jesse Goblet. All right, I can't keep up now. I'm so sorry. Well, God bless you guys from the Garden Tomb. I'm seeing all your comments here in Romania. I am at the Garden Tomb. That's just outside the walls of Jerusalem, Marie A. Good morning, Aaron Schuess, my brother. My brother together. I'm at a little place called the Gan, Ganakever, really, in Hebrew. The Garden Tomb. Let me just take you a walk through here. This place has been empty. At least tourists haven't been coming for 15 months or 14, something like that. And um, we were able to come in to film. Today is our last day of our virtual Israel tour for those who sign up for May. And um, the cool thing is uh, we're doing it again in June. So if you're interested, today is the last day to sign up for June. So um, I put the link below. It's just Joshua, Joshua Aaron dot tv joshua aaron dot tv so hope you guys are doing great um somebody's asking if this is the actual place where jesus yeshua was buried um well it's it, it could be <laughs> um those who run this place they always say we they, they never unequivocally say it is the place um but it is a place that fits uh it's a place that fits the description it's a garden of a wealthy man, tomb of a wealthy man, um, within the old city, uh, uh, to what would have been 2,000 years ago of Jerusalem, within within that um, within that area, and Golgotha, this place, the place of the skull. They're doing construction on the other side, but you can actually stand at the edge of this garden and see the place of the skull, where he would have been most likely been crucified, or at least near that area. So, this is not the Garden of Agony. This is the Garden tomb this is the garden tomb um that would be gethsemane i'd say right um on the mount of olives hello denver colorado guys let's walk over here get one little glimpse here from this angle and then i have to head out so i wanted to just say two things as we walk through the garden uh first was about the virtual tour if you're interested in coming seven full tour days um, where we filmed in advance and this is one we're filming on the day of the garden um, but we also have four lives so every sunday and wednesday um, you have um, seven videos plus four so 11 different videos four of those is live um, those who sign up uh, for the virtual tour um, and uh, it's all throughout the month of june so today's the last day to sign up for june if not you can sign up for july that'll be set up in a we might have it in july in a week or so so um, God bless you all the other thing is this place right here will be um, the place where we film our next live album live at the garden tomb so we're gonna set up a website garden tomb live dot com and um, you can find out how you can contribute to help us reach our goal to fund this a gigantic project we're gonna have a full band and fill this place with local in-country believers to come and worship God and hopefully share it with the world. Just like we did the Tower of David, we're going to bring it in here in the Garden Tomb. Um, so I am loving seeing you guys all on here. I put the link below. I'm also going to put the link below for the Garden Tomb. Um, just go to gardentomb.com, T-O-M-B, uh, gardentomb.com. If you guys want to um, support the garden by purchasing their products, um, one of the things we send in a gift box to those who sign up for our virtual tour is a little olive wood cup um, when we do our communion at the end and, and they sell those in the, in, in the mass amounts and uh, all sorts of beautiful things here from the garden. So let me just turn it around one more time. 
I am back from Hawaii a, lo a long time now, a couple weeks now, and that was great. Somebody's asking about Hawaii. It was, it was good, stressful knowing my family was under, you know, in a war while I was in Hawaii, but I made it back a couple days after. And of course, we're several days into the ceasefire, so just feeling the peace today, especially this, time, this side of Jerusalem. Um, they were having riots in the evenings here from what my friend was saying that lives here. So it's so great to see this, this peace over this place. Let me walk you down one last time before I head out. You guys want to go inside the, the tomb? So when you guys come to Israel, this is the way you'd come down. Hi, Rachie Sherlock. Thank you. The tomb. Oh man, oh man, hopefully you guys can still see here. But it's an empty tomb, right? Can you tell? <laughs> well, God bless you. I hope this is a blessing to you to get to come here and just to get a glimpse as this place really has been closed for, for well over a year. So blessings to you from the garden tomb. I'm gonna sign off and say, say goodbye to my friends here, Brian and Cesar, and thank them for letting us come in to film. Um, during our virtual tour. Um, I'm hoping I see a few of you on here that are on our virtual tour. It's gonna be a great farewell uh, with a special guest that showed up. Of course, the guide Caesar was an amazing guide. Um, so if you wanna come join us in Israel virtually, just go to joshuaaron.tv. And also, um, all right up here, we, we're, we're starting to plan our Live at the Garden Tomb album coming out. We're gonna film it this fall and probably release it in the early spring. So God bless you from the garden tomb. Let me show you one more time before I, uh, before I sign off.